Today I join with Governor Rick Perry uh, to assert litigation against uh, the United States Environmental Protection Agency. Uh, the U.S. EPA uh, issued a finding saying that greenhouse gases uh, pose a problem uh, here in our country and therefore must be regulated. Uh, the finding by the EPA uh, is going to be extremely harmful uh, to Texas families, to Texas ranchers, farmers, schools, businesses. Uh, nationally, it could cost Americans billions, if not maybe even a trillion dollars. But the reason why we have to challenge this finding is because the EPA relied upon faulty scientific information in arriving at its conclusions uh, that CO2 and other greenhouse gases pose a danger to people in this country. The, what the EPA did was to not undertake its own scientific analysis. Instead, the EPA farmed out that analysis to an organization under the umbrella of the United Nations. That organization is called the IPCC, and the IPCC also re re relied upon information from another organization called the Climate Research Unit. Recent emails and other discoveries have revealed uh, that the data created by the IPCC and the CRU turned out to be sometimes fabricated, sometimes false, uh, completely unscientific. Uh, they came up with things such as that glaciers in the Himalayas uh, would melt by the year 2035. Turned out that four weeks ago, the IPCC had to recant uh, that allegation. That's just one of countless errors that were contained in a report sent to the EPA that the EPA relied upon in coming up with its conclusions. So we filed this lawsuit uh, asking the EPA to reconsider its conclusions uh, and to uh, eliminate the onerous restrictions that they will be placing upon Texans and our fellow Americans.